Looks like uh, President Biden is set to get out of his limo uh, momentarily here. I guess the Secret Service detail strong, opening the door, and let's watch and listen. Well, you could see a very uh, brief greeting there by uh, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, one of them saying, great to see you. Uh, U.S. President Biden smiling, extending his hand, wearing those familiar aviator sunglasses as he got out of his limo and arrived uh, at Mackenzie Tower, the entrance to the West Block here. So as the reporters circle into another entrance uh, to go in and sort of cover the rest of this, inside Parliament Hill, there is much more to come here. The bilateral meetings getting underway, a greeting ceremony, welcoming ceremony happening as well. And we're back live inside uh, West Block here on Parliament Hill, where uh, U.S. President Joe Biden has just arrived. We're seeing some of the security detail uh, making their way towards the uh, official welcoming ceremony for the U.S. president. The first time Joe Biden will be welcomed in Canada formally as president of the United States. So we watch that door uh, and wait for the president to turn the corner. Uh, when he does turn that corner, he's going to be greeted by uh, people like the speakers of the House and Senate. Uh, we've seen in some other pictures here uh, leaders of all the federal uh, federal parties here: the Green Party, Conservative Party, New Democrats, uh, Bloc Québécois, Yves François, Yves -François Blanchet, uh, Pierre Polyev there as well. I didn't see Jagmeet Singh, but I'm sure he will be there as well. And Elizabeth May would be along with that. Uh, they will be the party leaders doing a bit of a meet and greet. Uh, we also do understand as the president and prime minister walk in. Let's uh, watch this and listen, and then and then get back to what else is going on. Back up at the, at the end. Come on. No, no, no. That's the George Fury is the Mr. Speaker, how are you? Good to see you again here. Thank you so much for coming. I met you last week of the uh, House of Commons. Yeah, Pleasure to meet you, President. That's your room, Tom. Looks like Curtin the Cat. Yeah, times it is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Great to see you. Nice Mr. to see you President as well. Marco, I'm the government representative in the Senate. I'm the son and grandson of very proud Democrats. My mom's from Florida. Oh, is that right? So it's a pleasure oh, to meet you, God. sir. Welcome. God love you. Thank you. Mr. President Pierre Pauliet, leader of His Majesty's loyal opposition. Loyal Absolutely. We believe that opposition is an act of loyalty in our system. <laughs> I, we do, too. We do right. too, unfortunately. <laughs> 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 Dennis Patterson, the Senator from Nunavut, Northern Canada. Nice to meet you, sir. Up there. Yeah, and we're uh, going to modernize. We're going to modernize NORAD and guard Good. guard North America for you. Good. Pierre Dalphonus, the president, the leader of the Progressive in the Senate, and I think the other one. Thank you. 
Okay, uh, so U.S. President Joe Biden has just uh, exchanged pleasantries with, uh, I suppose, more than a dozen uh, high-profile members of uh, the parliamentary precinct of various roles, senators, uh, politicians, etc., House leaders, um, ex exchanging uh, lots of pleasantries with them, uh, you know, uh, even joking around with a, a conservative opposition leader. As he said, the leader of Her Majesty's loyal opposition, and uh, Joe Biden made a joke about the loyal opposition. He also had some words with, uh, of course, NDP leader Jagmeet Singh. He, and, uh, Jagmeet Singh speaking of specifically of New Democratic Party, which, of course, Joe Biden, leader of the Democratic Party uh, south of the border as well. Uh, and, uh, you know, he's just signed the guest book again for the first time as president. This is a lot of the formalities here. Uh, and these are a lot of what we are going to uh, sort of see and show you here in Ottawa, because most, of course, of what's going to be happening uh, in Ottawa... Uh, all day today, these bilateral meetings continue. We'll be behind closed doors. We even saw the Green Party leader, Elizabeth May, uh, handing President Biden a, a chocolate bar with a green wrapper with the word peace uh, on it as well. I don't know if that was a green peace uh, necessarily, but that was uh, what was given out. Uh, you, you could hear others say, oh, look, and he asked for the chocolate bar back. Uh, as well. So I, I'm assuming it's a chocolate bar. Nevertheless, uh, the meetings are getting underway as the welcome ceremony is, is taking place right now. Again, they are running significantly behind this morning, but that doesn't mean there aren't a lot of important items uh, on the agenda here, as, uh, of course, the Prime Minister uh, and President have a lot of issues that they need to speak about. Uh, you know, first and foremost, whether it's uh, migration, whether it's trade, uh, whether it's China, whether it's the war in Ukraine. The two leaders are now going to go behind closed doors, uh, again, for these what they call bilateral meetings, where the two sides, the two, uh, the two countries, of course, the leaders of the two countries will be speaking.